Hey Raiders, welcome back to another Live Arena Battle video. This video will feature three fights and two wins. So let's get started. So first I face Darken. And he ends up being about the same uh, account power as me and one progression point below me. So we're right at the same spot. I go UDK first and he goes the two that UDK counters with Rodos and Sifi. So I'll finish off the tanky. And maybe I should have gone Goffred here instead of Necret, but I don't like it when they get Necret and Rodos. So I went Duchess, Necret. They go Lady Makagi, and they go Wukong. So I, ban I want to ban Lady Makagi, and I hope they don't go Yumiko or Warlord. I go Xena to counter the Sifi, and I go Staltus in there too, and he's great at countering Rodos. So they go Baron. They have three damagers, and I'm going to ban the Lady Makagi. They're going to ban the Ultimate Death Knight. So Baron could wipe my team... But we'll see how it goes. So Sifi, is she going to sleep or buff? Is going to sleep the Staltus. I will buff Xena. Rodos can't do anything. And Wukong steals some buffs. And then Baron goes, doesn't kill anybody, and Xena's able to counterattack kill him. So if I can get that Sifi gone, then we're golden. I can't protect the Staltus because he has block buffs on. I kill the Sifi. Rodos is triggered. He's going to take out the Necret. And then he couldn't take out a Damager, so he had to go for my Duchess. She still had Stone Skin, and then I'm able to take everyone out with Xena. So Xena is a great counter to Sifi. Forces Sifi to have to sleep somebody or take the risk that Xena can one-shot the team after Sifi buffs. So we'll see who we get next. And someone from Mad, it's Arthemtus, and he ends up having 56 million player power. A plus four CP he starts it off with. I almost left right when I saw that, but I decided to go ahead and fight through it. Then he goes plus four Kaimar, and then he goes Shuzen, and I'll go the Necret, and I will go Xena. So I'm looking at banning the Shuzen. She is the most dangerous right now. And he's going to go Georgid and... Trunda, I'm pretty sure he was just toying with me that he probably has... I know he has Marichka, because that's who's on his classic defense right now. Maybe he doesn't have Taurus, but at 56 million player power, he probably has about everybody. But, see how this goes. Is he going to buff, or is he any buffs? So that triggers Xena, and Xena's able to kill their two attackers after being triggered. So then Kaimar sleeps my two damagers, which is really unlikely. Had that not happened, I might have won. It was very unlikely, though. And then Xena's able to take out Necret and... Or Trunda's able to take out Necret and Xena, which, again, kind of unlikely, but happens. And then I come within about 1% to 5% of taking out Sifi. They'll revive the Georgian, and I'm done. He'll basically two-shot me, and that's it. The two-star Awakening used to have defense, and they just changed that, so if that had not changed, I would have had enough damage with Staltus to kill the CV. So I'm still waiting on the three-star. So I almost had that guy, but I think he wasn't using his top champions. Or maybe he was, maybe he was trying something different. So I try another one, and I get lucky here, he just gets disconnected. So I'll take that win. Almost makes up for the near win against the mad player. So, in any case, hope you enjoyed the video, and take care. Thank you.